I'd like to take this opportunity to thank the ABCA and Jostens uh, for this award. Um, I'd also like to thank and congratulate, excuse me, congratulate, Nina Matthews, Terry Condon, and Stephanie Schluter on their induction into the ABCA Hall of Fame. It's quite humbling to, be, to be included with such an outstanding and, de and deserving group of coaches. I need to first of all thank one of my former coaches, Sean Byron, who wrote the nomination, and those of you who supported it with your letters. I certainly appreciate it. The Hall of Fame, the ABC Hall of Fame, inducted its first class in 2003 and now has 70 members. And this group, I know, includes some of the greatest names in our sport. And as I read over the names this past summer, it made me realize how lucky I am to have been helped by and influenced by many current and I'm sure former members of this Hall of Fame. And at this point in time, I'd like to acknowledge and say thank you to a few of them. The first two, my two college coaches, Mick Haley, who I see sitting right over here to the right, and Don Shondell, who gave a young guy from Toe Rubber, Michigan, a chance to play the game and grow to enjoy it beyond just being a player. Uh, my thanks also to some coaches who got me started. Coach Jim Stone, Arnie Ball, Doug Beal, Bill Neville, Jim Coleman, Fred Sturm, Jim McLaughlin, Russ Rose, Tom Tate, and countless others who not only helped me begin my coaching career, but offered mentoring along the way, not only in their own programs, but those of USA Volleyball. I'm certainly grateful to the Ohio State University, the athletic administrators that began the volleyball program, and to those who have continued to support it during my time at Ohio State. I've had the pleasure of working for and with many great people at Ohio State. Athletic directors Andy Geiger, Gene Smith, Michelle Willis, Janine Oman. Their commitment as administrators have allowed the Ohio State men's volleyball program to flourish and succeed since, since 1968. I need to thank a group of men that have meant so much to me in my career, and those are the people that have been on my staff during my time at Ohio State. Coach Tim Embaugh, Coach Sean Byron, currently Coach Kevin Birch, and many of our young men who played at Ohio State who volunteered with our program and are now coaches themselves. Colin McMillan, Ben Spurlock, Chuck Voss, Dan Matthews, Ray Gooden, Dan Meske, Tim Doyle, Sean Sangre, and many, many others. A former coach at Ohio State said this, you can never pay back but you can always pay forward. And I can never pay back to all those who have not only helped me, but have helped our volleyball program at Ohio State. We can, however, as a program and as a coaching staff, pay forward by providing an opportunity where young men can come and attend an outstanding university, be a member of a program that will help them pursue their dreams of playing college volleyball, learn the values of teamwork, dedication, commitment, and perhaps one day some of them will go forward and pay forward to this sport. And lastly, I need to thank my family. Um, my wife and my two sons, John and Phil, uh, who many, many times knew that dad wasn't there to watch a lot of their events. I was with the Ohio State volleyball team. But nonetheless, when I came home, they usually asked, how'd you do? Glad to see you, glad you're home. And clearly, without their love and support, to do this job is an impossible task. So to them, I'm very grateful, and thank you very much.